Hey guys, Shannon B here again. So, um, I got a PlayStation 3 now, and I got this really cool game. So, I am going to go to it. I also got to tell the grades of that for my birthday. And then I also got um, another game called Etrian Odyssey Untold the Millennium Girl, and then I also got, um, uh, what else did I get? Alright, Pokemon Heart, Heart Gold. And so today I'm going to be playing a game called Tokyo Jungle. Um, uh, was originally for, um, people in Japan, then brought to, then was brought to America. America! And, um, it's, um, a downloadable game from the PS Store, so, yeah. Now, it's not all that popular, but, um, I just thought I'd show you guys what it is. So, as usual, I'm going to begin the game with the tutorial, slash beginning, slash whatever. And also, um... You probably had to be like, what? Probably like, maybe 13 or 14. Probably 14 to play this game. But, um, I'm a 12 year old and I don't really care about my age. Ugh, my ripped pants are annoying me. Like, there's this huge rip in the part on my knee, and it's really bugging me. I thought it made, it made me look, like, cool and tomboyish, but now I decided that it's really bugging me. So, yeah. Ripped shorts and jungles in Tokyo and rabbit animals, oh my. So we're going to go to the story. We're going to start the tutorial. Mankind has vanished, leaving Tokyo overrun with animals fighting to survive. Let's take a closer look at this brave new natural order. So, it's been the tutorial. Blood. Humankind has vanished. A decade later, Tokyo's familiar landscape has become a home to beast, a jungle. Pets have turned feral. Wild animals have escaped from the zoo. Racehorses have been freed from servitude. Let's take a look at this brave new natural order. Also, I um, am now obsessed with course party. Bleh. So once I've owned enough, I'm probably going to be like posting a lot of stuff about it. Because stuff, stuff, and stuff. Step on stealth. If you hope to survive, do not allow stronger animals to see you. Yeah. Tall grass offers vital cover. Oh, these shorts are really annoying. The grass blocks other animals' lines of sight. Leaving the grass will expose you. So yeah, try not to get caught, kids. <laughs> Reach your destination using the grass to stay hidden. So another thing, you can use L1 to crawl if there's no grass. 
And then there's another thing, but I'll show you guys that later. Woo! Oh, snap. Woo! So you can jump by pressing X. Just tap it for a shorter jump and hold it for a higher jump. So yeah, now we're hunting. Kitty cat. Predators live by catching and eating other animals. The hunger god shows your current hunger level. Unless you eat, the hunger god will reach zero and you will begin to lose life. If an animal's life reaches zero, it will die. Look there, a rabbit. Approach it without being seen, then go in for the kill. Ooh. I like violence. No, not really. Oh, that scared me. I thought I lost. <laughs> Once in striking distance, an icon will appear to indicate timing. Press R1 the moment the bite icon turn turns red to lunge. Rawr. Strip your prey's bones and eat your food. So you can carry your prey by holding circle. So yeah. And drop it by tapping circle again. So yay, we're happy full kitty cat now. <clears throat> Their muzzles look so derpy. But this game is really detailed and realistic. So yeah, this is a really good game. I've already made a lot of progress, so yeah. In the law of the jungle, animals must compete for food. The scent of a fresh kill has drawn hyenas. You can't deliver a killing bite while the animal is watching you. First, you must create an opening. So yeah, basically it's fight. Press the square button claw and expose a hyena to attack. Rawr. Get back here! The hyena's guard is down. End it with a well timed bite. No, no, no. <clears throat> Enemies will attempt to catch you in their own jaws. If successful, the attack is fatal, but if you evade it, they are exposed to counter attack. When the bite icon appears over the beagle, evade, 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 then counter. You eluded the hyena's jaws. The hyena is left wide open. Don't let this chance slip by. Bite the hyena back. Rawr! Even victors are rarely unscathed. The enemy has a pack. The danger rises. The hyena pack is just beyond. Use claw and fang to claim their territory for your own. Blade. Ew, blade. That was way too close for comfort. Oh crap! Whoops, sorry for language, guys! <laughs> uh. Yeah. Step four grazers. I'm a sick of deer now. Grazers are herbivores. They survive by eating plants. They don't have to hunt, but are poor fighters as a result. Well, some of them, like this sick of deer. Plants grow in a wide variety of places. The plant icon on your radar shows their position. 
eat three types of plants without being seen by predators, aka that wolf. Oh, I'm so scared. Oh, great bee drills. Uh. Also, grazers can double jump, so yeah. The hyena has seen you. A sigdir stands no chance against a hyena. There, a stand of tall grass. Run for cover in the grass before the hyena catches you. If you can enter a stand of tall grass before predators get too close, you can lose them. After losing sight of prey, a predator will try to track them by scent. If you're sufficiently far and hidden from view, your scent will fade, and the chance will be found decreases. When the danger guard drops to zero, the enemy will give up and move on. It seems you've escaped with your life this time. I'm a fluffy golden retriever. At age 15, an animal's life approaches its end. It must mate and reproduce. Ah! Face palm fail. I hit the table thing instead. Or die out. So, yeah. Yay. Before I you must secure your own territory. Reading that kind of stuff makes me really uncomfortable. Four marking points exist throughout the Shibuya Station area. Use your radar to locate them. You can also see the precise location by pressing start to view your map. So, let's get to it. Mark each of these four points to claim Shibuya Station for your own. Whee! Whoa, my camera is way slower than the actual game. I'm so slow! Ugh! So why don't you read some freaking course party fanfiction novel? Well, once again, sorry for language. I don't. Well. Yeah, never mind. So one time in Tokyo Jungle, I was playing with a friend, and she was playing as a golden retriever. And she tried to kill a hippo, and she kill she was killed. And I was like an antelope gazelle thing. And then suddenly the hippo attacked me and killed me. So I was like, "What the flip? I'm a grazer. I don't eat meat." Oh god. And so basically, it's. You're in a pack, and you attack, uh, attack an animal, then it's going to be attacking you both, even if you are friendly to it. Blame. And also, you can't eat your own kind, obviously. And you're in a pack, and you're two different species. And you try to, and if you do kill an animal that is of your own kind, then neither of you can eat it. Because well, it's fine. It it's difficult to explain. So yeah, keep an eye out for all these random tips. They may actually help you. The Shibuya Station Lair is now yours to use. This perfect. Camera is 
lagging so badly. There are three grades of mates. Prime, average, and desperate. But the best females will only respond to males of a certain caliber. Perform hunts to raise your standing as a male. This golden retriever hasn't reached a sufficient rank to interest her. Hunt down prey and feed to the and feed to refine your skills as a male. Ugh. There is also a I am so terrible. Also, I know this is off topic, but there is um, a fan fiction on DeviantArt called Course Party Fading Scars. So go check that out when you have time. Thank you for watching this at this this at okay. I I I am so um you could say gamers block. Yeah, let's call it that. I don't really know what to say. It's so hard. Man, I'm harsh. Guys. This poor sheep, though. Come here, you stupid chimp. Dang it. Get back here. It seems he reached a sufficient rank. So that's a prime female. Also drink water to gain your hunger back. So yeah. Oh my glob! How stupid are you, you stupid female? Uh, children inherit a portion of the skill their parents cultivated. Yeah, this was originally Japanese, so they probably had some trouble with this. <laughs> I am not going to look at this part because it's strictly thoroughly. We are now, oh my gosh, so many puppies. <laughs> so, yeah, that was basically the whole tutorial. Yep. Hunting, feeding, fleeing, mating, these are the acts that define an animal's life. The fight to survive is never easy, but only the bitches live to see where the future leads. It's the dawn of another day in the Tokyo jungle. I don't know why they put dinosaurs in, but that's just Japan. Japan is Japan. Also, check out this awesome YouTuber called Sage the Furry Otaku. Otaku. Say Shifuri Otaku. Sorry. Um, she's really awesome. So, yeah, that's going to be the end of that. Of this gameplay video. Please leave a comment. Can be. Um, if you hate me or not. I don't care. Just feed me attention, guys. But don't start to flame more just because you have your own opinions on this game and stuff. I don't like that kind of thing. 
or leave a like or even a dislike and subscribe. Um, not really sure of what else to say, but other than um, check out future channels. Otherwise, I swear to vlog. I will get a Chico, and I will come to your house, and we will both haunt it together forever. Yeah. I am a very odd person. So with that, um, peace out, spread the love, and sayonara.